Here's another story that we follow very closely, the demise of Harvey Weinstein. He was once a big-time member of the elitist left in Hollywood. They're trying to keep their distance from him now. Uh, our next guest, though, claims that Weinstein, he's just the tip of the iceberg, says Gabe Hoffman. He is the producer of An Open Secret. Uh, Gabe, welcome to the program. Good to see you. Thanks for having me, Stuart. That's your expression, tip of the iceberg. Quantify it. Is this happening all over Hollywood? Sure. You just heard about Tyler Grasham the other day. Uh, we think he's the Harvey Weinstein of young boys. And it's really that, that, wonderful. That's pedophilia? Yes. That's underage boys. Uh, he's a big uh, agent. He's had a lot of stars that have been on shows. And it's interesting. You hear about uh, some of these big uh, stars that are coming out. It's wonderful. Jennifer Lawrence, Reese Witherspoon, talking about when they were underage with these predators. But you don't hear about the kids. You hear about them in our film. Now, that's an open secret. That's, yes. that's what now, your film is all about, preying on young boys. Is that correct? Absolutely. Pedophilia in Hollywood. We've had over two million views since we made it free. It was the film that Hollywood didn't want you to see. I guess it wasn't a bad title we came up with two years ago, right? Okay, but have you put out names of people that... You oh, assume? absolutely. In fact, in An Open Secret, we uncover, unmask, and get them to admit on camera one of the biggest uh, child uh, talent agents and uh, coaches in Hollywood the last 30, 40 years. Good Lord. Now... All this is being revealed now. It's all coming out now, thanks to you, your movie, and others who are coming forward. Am I going to still get moral lectures from Hollywood when I watch the Oscars <laughs> next year or the Golden Globes? I'm not being question. facetious. I mean, question. look, no, I, a you know, I, it's a fair question because, frankly, I'm sick and tired of yeah. it. Are we going to just keep seeing it? I totally agree with you. But what we really should see is some Hollywood stars come out and start talking about how can Hollywood better protect children? How can Hollywood get these actual convicted pedophiles off of sets, like Brian Peck, who worked on Charlie Sheen's Anger Management, or Victor Salva, who directed Jeepers Creepers, and they just did Jeepers Creepers 3 in 2017. Actual convicted pedophiles still working in Hollywood. Why is Hollywood so left of center? I I'm, I'm keep dragging this back to politics and away from your movie. I know I'm doing that, but I'm just intrigued. I don't understand why this whole group of very well-paid people are so far on the left, so consistently. It seems like the laws, even in the Socialist Republic of California, are, are you know, part and parcel with what you're saying, Stuart. For example, in our film, we show how a victim who got his predator on tape, got a plea deal, multiple counts, guess what? He served six months in prison. Ugh. That's it? Yes. Your movie is called An Open Secret. Correct. I don't watch it in movie houses do, at the cinema. I don't, it's not there. Is it, where is it? I don't see it. We put it for free online. It's at our social, at An Open Secret, and at our Facebook. We made it free until October 31st, and over 2 million people have watched it. Hollywood didn't want you to see it. They blocked distribution. We were waiting for an Harvey Weinstein moment to come and release it for free. Why did you do it for free? What, you feel strongly about this? I mean, you made it for free. Somebody spent some money here. Well, absolutely, and we didn't have to rely on Hollywood. Luckily, I've been uh, blessed and successful as a fund manager, so uh, I was able Wait to back it. That's your background? Yes. You're a financial guy? Totally. You ran a hedge fund, something like that? I was the youngest hedge fund manager on Wall Street 17 years ago and still going strong. How old were you then? 23 years old. Wow. So now you're 40. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you made a ton of money. Haven't done bad, been very blessed and successful, and when my co-producer, Matt Valentinas, brought this topic to me, we had all the research done with disarming films, and it was really incredible. We have an Oscar-nominated director on the same topic, Amy Berg, in the Catholic Church, Deliver Us From Evil. Our film got a 93 rating on Rotten Tomatoes, percent positive reviews, from even liberals like the New York Times and Variety, yet the film festivals wouldn't let us in. You got an uphill battle. Yeah. Well, we're very pleased to have you on this program. And the movie, again, is An Open Secret. Two million views already, free until October 31st, did you say? Correct. All right, sir, Gabe Hoffman, thanks for joining us, sir. We do appreciate it, sir. We really Thank do. Thank you for having us. Yes.